the exact same acres, guys, the exact same acres, you're going to overgraze, you're going to graze out a lot of the favorable stuff, you're going to create more room for more of those forbs, okay, to come up in here and all of that, you're going to lose productivity, lose biomass production, lose microbial activity, all of that, you're going to heat up your soil, you're going to have a lot of moisture loss, you've got negative compounding cascading effects that harm you economically, and you're going to lose forage biomass productivity without applying a lot of external fertilizers. And now that, I just cost myself money there, right? Okay? So you can't afford not to if you move them at least once every day. The simple act of doing that alone, just that act, will automatically, in the same season, listen carefully, in the same growing season, will grow you two to two and a half times more forage. Did you hear that? Repeat it. In the same season, moving once a day, every day versus once a week, will automatically grow you two to two and a half times more forage. Do you not want that? Without fertilizer, without spending a penny on applying anything, over three years to four years, you will increase biomass production by three and a half to five times over what you were when you were moving just once a week or every two weeks or once a month. Two moves a day get more than that? Two moves a day gets more than that. Yep. Exactly. It, compounding cascading effects, either positive or negative, the rule of compounding, right? And I see you. Let me say one more okay. thing and we'll, we'll get to your question. Now, I want to ask this question first. Got to build a 1.3 acre paddock. You don't have time. How long does it take to build a 1.3 acre poly wire tread in post paddock? How long? 20 minutes. That's taking your time. I know. I can do a half mile. 